NBC2 News at 11. You know darn well as soon as they put that food place up, they're going to add liquor to it. Right. Do you want your kids out here playing with a bunch of drunks? No. Starting tomorrow morning, J.C. Park will be closed for at least a year for major renovations, and some people in Cape Coral are fighting the controversial decision till the very end. Thank you for watching NBC2. I'm Peter Bush. The city is pushing through changes that they say will make the park better for more people. NBC2 Samantha Romero is at the park where some people are planning one last protest. There will be a construction fence around J.C. Park starting tomorrow morning. Tonight, it was the last hurrah for some residents before the closures, but others tell me they plan to be here tomorrow morning to protest. Trees and there's lots of wildlife here. This is the last time you'll see this. The squirrel and the, uh, the bridge with the trees. Or hear this for at least a year as J.C. Park closes Tuesday morning for major changes. Well, they're closing it tonight, so I knew the right thing to do would be to come here tonight. As it being the last night with me and Buddy, my, my dog here, who uh, also loves this place. City officials are planning on adding a boat dock, a band shell, new pavilions, and a food truck court, among other amenities. For some, tonight was the last time they'll come to the park before it closes down for these changes. We probably would have come again tomorrow, but I guess now we'll have to find somewhere else. For others, unless I break through the fence, nothing will stop them. Which, if it's not too hard, I will. Cape Coral resident Pamela Conroy says she's come to this park every day for years, and she's not planning to change that. Nine o'clock tomorrow morning, we're having a rally. She and a group of seniors say they'll be here tomorrow protesting the changes to the park. I said to my husband, I said, can you afford to bail me out if they arrest me? He said, yeah, we'll find a way to bail you out. <laughs> he said, go ahead. <laughs> I'm not going to bring the dog tomorrow just in case we do get arrested. The city says site preps will start once they secure the park. Count on NBC2 to keep you updated on the changes. Local in Cape Coral at JC Park, Samantha Romero, NBC2.